Let's talk about our local weather here in West Texas. Live look right now at downtown San Angelo. It's not looking too bad. We've had lots of sunshine all day long today. Temperatures, it got hot out there. Low 90s for afternoon temps. And it's still hot here in San Angelo. 90 degrees right now. Feels like 86 thanks to a low humidity. Only 21% dew point sitting at 45. 77 degrees. Much cooler right now up in Abilene with a north wind at about 9 miles an hour. Severe thunderstorm watch off to our northwest. That includes Mitchell and Scurry counties off towards Lubbock and into southeastern New Mexico. Tornado watch off to our northeast including southeastern Oklahoma up to the DFW area all the way down towards Waco. And this includes Comanche County here in our local area back here. Abilene San Angelo not included in any watch at the current moment. We are tracking the one severe thunderstorm warning off to our northwest right now. And that's in Mitchell and uh, Scurry counties here in effect until 6.45 p.m. As we zoom in to this particular storm, we we're talking about this earlier, south of Snyder, this hail core pushing on off to the east uh, through southern Scurry County. That's where the hail core is right now up to golf ball size reported south of Snyder. This will say, uh, stay south of Snyder as it continues to push through southern uh, Scurry County. Temperatures out there right now, much cooler up in the big country thanks to this cold front that's moving on through. It's a weak front, still 90 here in San Angelo. It's 87 in Ballinger, 76 in Sweetwater, 71 right now in Snyder. So you see the temperature variant compared to Junction that is currently sitting at 96 degrees. Where we don't see those storms north of Interstate 20, it's going to stay dry. Temperatures cooling off will be in the upper 50s for overnight lows. More morning cloud cover expected across West Texas. So tonight, the main area of concern is north of Interstate 20 and then some nasty storms towards DFW. So if you have family and friends up in the DFW area, make sure they are weather aware and uh, keeping up to date with the local warnings up in that area. For our area, it's mainly north of Interstate 20. So up in the big country, we'll watch for an isolated storm or two. Most of the area stays dry. Overnight tonight, increasing cloud cover. May see some drizzle developing early tomorrow morning. And that's the best we're going to do. We'll burn off those clouds to get towards the afternoon hours tomorrow. So uh, morning clouds, p.m. sun expected for your Tuesday. Temperatures tomorrow much cooler thanks to that cold front. North winds at about 10 to 15 miles an hour. We'll only top off in the low to mid 70s across West Texas. So about 10 degrees below average tomorrow. Then we warm right back up. So your seven day forecast up in Abilene. It's dry for the remainder of the week. 80s return Wednesday and Thursday looking absolutely fantastic. Warming up a little bit though as we head into the coming weekend, especially here in the Concho Valley. We'll climb back to the low to mid 90s. Relatively dry for the rest of the week. The only slight chance of a shower may be on Friday. We'll watch that carefully. Otherwise, we're dry and warm for the remainder of this week. Much more coming up after the break.